Hi guys, it's Olivia Jordan and I am Miss USA 2015. Welcome to my bedroom and today I'm going to share the top 10 things that you might not know about me. Number one, I am left-handed. I know because my left hand has the freckle. That's how I used to tell it apart when I was a kid. But Left-handed people have a lot of struggles in life. Tools are not made for us. Notebooks, you're always running into the binder rings. And when you write thank you notes, you blur the whole note and get ink on your hand. These are big challenges that we have to overcome as left-handers. Number two, I am a Friends fanatic. I've been watching Friends since I was a little girl, and I remember the finale episode. I cried with my friends as we said goodbye to the show but I still watch it on a regular basis every day. It was life changing when it came on Netflix and I just could not be any more obsessed with friends. Number three, my sister was homecoming queen in high school and she looked so amazing and I was so happy for her, but I was always a little jealous that she got to wear a tiara and now I finally have my own tiara. Ah. <laughs> I am a fourth generation Tulsan and in Tulsa, we have a legacy in my family. My great-grandmother started Margot's Gift Shop, my grandmother took over, and now my aunt owns Margot's, and I actually grew up working there and helping with inventory and learning how to do amazing gift wrapping. So stop by Margot's if you're ever in Tulsa because it's a huge part of my family history. Number five, I sucked my thumb until I was eight years old when I was going to bed at night because it gave me comfort and helped me go to sleep but my mom told me no more when I started getting invited to sleepovers. She said I had to cut that habit before I would go to my girlfriend's houses. So at eight, I finally was able to put the thumb away and be a grown up. Next, my grandmother was so obsessed with elephants and coming from a big family, you had to find ways to become your grandmother's favorite. So I always told her I was obsessed with elephants and now the reality is I am and I like to wear an elephant with the trunk up because it brings good luck and it reminds me of my grandma. I once won a pie baking contest in college for my sorority. All the sororities competed for best pie and all the fraternities competed for best chili and I got voted best pie. It did not look pretty, I'll tell you, but it tasted delicious. Reese's Pieces, chocolate, whipped cream, it was fantastic. <laughs> JLo is my lifelong idol. I've always loved her, she's just fantastic. Who can sing, dance, act, and look that phenomenal in a dress every single time? She's remarkable, I think she's some form of perfection, and sometimes I make my friends call me Ojo, just so I can be a little more like her. Number nine, nine for September because I'm a September 28th baby and I'm a Libra. And my horoscope for July was pretty spot on because it said that some great things were gonna happen, that my family was gonna come together and 30 people from Tulsa came to Baton Rouge and also that this is gonna be the busiest next two years of my life, which I think I'm on track for that right now. <laughs> I am obsessed with puppies, like maybe to an extreme degree. When I see a dog walking down the street, I call all dogs puppies by the way, when I see a dog walking down the street, I will talk to him, I will say, hi puppy, how are you? And I really freak some people out. I think I may need to like mellow out this behavior in New York because it's, it's scaring people. But getting a little pet, sharing your love with a puppy, there's nothing better than that. Thanks for learning some random things about me. I hope you feel like you know all there is to know. You'll be learning a lot more this year. So stay tuned, follow everything we put out there. It's gonna be a very fun year.